Rubidium. The 37th element on the periodic table is a soft, silvery white alkali metal with an atomic weight of 85.47. Like its neighbors lithium, sodium, and potassium, rubidium is highly reactive especially with water, so much so that it bursts into flames on contact. Rubidium was discovered in 1861 by Robert Bunsen and Gustav Kirchhoff using flame spectroscopy which revealed its bright reddish-violet spectral lines. That fury color inspired its name, which comes from the Latin rubidus, meaning deep red. Rubidium is relatively rare compared to other alkali metals, but it's still more abundant than elements like silver or iodine. Because of its extreme reactivity, rubidium is never found in its pure elemental form in nature and it's usually found in minerals like lipidolite and pellucite, and is typically extracted as a byproduct of lithium production. When isolated, it must be stored under inert gas or mineral oil to prevent it from reacting with air or moisture. One of rubidium's most important uses is in atomic clocks. Rubidium atomic clocks are very precise thanks to a specific frequency of microwave radiation that rubidium atoms emit when they change energy states. This constant oscillation makes rubidium clocks accurate to within a few billionths of a second, making them perfect for GPS systems, telecommunications, and scientific instruments where precise timekeeping is essential. Rubidium's radioactivity has also been used to locate brain tumors as it collects in tumors but not in normal tissue. Plus, rubidium's similarity to potassium makes rubidium ions useful in biological research. Because they can mimic potassium in cells, rubidium is used in tracers to study things like nerve signal transmission and brain function in medical imaging and physiological experiments. Rubidium also has applications in specialized electronics and vacuum tubes, where its low ionization energy makes it useful for producing electrons easily in photoelectric devices and plasma applications. Its high reactivity and ability to ionize readily makes it a candidate for use in ion propulsion systems for spacecraft, where ions are ejected to generate thrust in space.